that backfield was unbelievable. They really found some gaps that I couldn't even see when we were rewatching on the video board. And uh, I'm just really proud how we just came together as a team and as a unit and really just rode the ship and came out on top. What was the mood the locker room after this one? And what do you think this um, means, you know, big picture? Big picture, team? I think uh, it's just going to give us momentum. And that's what we need. We're a young team. And I think momentum is our, our biggest ally at this point, is mm -hmm. being able to have that momentum going into K-State, which is a hostile environment. Bill Snyder, you know, he's a son of a gun. I mean, he really knows what he's doing. Mm -hmm. And he's a sly fox. So we got to go into that game with the momentum and the toughness we had in this game and make a statement there in Kansas. It's not like you guys wake up in week five and say, hey, just going to be a pretty good passing team and not knock guys off the ball. How does it how does it ebb and flow as an offensive lineman throughout the year? Have you seen this happen before? We almost have a different identity for a month and sure. then you have to get it back. And then no, I've never seen it before, and it quite frankly pisses me off because up front we should have been uh, playing more aggressive, even in pass protection and run blocking. I think that uh, this week when Coach Holgerson challenged the offensive line and the defensive line, I think it was a real big wake-up call for some of the older guys and some of the younger guys that really got to put it in gear because these teams coming up, if we could have run the ball against these guys, we would have lost this game by God knows how many because they drop eight every dang, uh, dang time, and we really had to pull it out and run the ball.